Hi guys, Bill Nichols, Bill Nichols TV. I'm here with Eric Mizafuku. He's a product manager for Epson. Today we're looking at the Epson BT300. It's a transparent uh, first person view screen that's a binocular type vision that sits in front of you. Um, so Eric, what can you tell us about the BT300? Yeah, so the BT300, as you mentioned, it's a transparent display. So they're really augmented reality glasses. So what we can do is render 3D digital content in your field of view. It's got a front-facing camera, so for the drone audience, they can record in the background uh, you know, their view of the drone. Uh, they can also visualize uh, telemetry data, the FPV view of the, the UAV, and it's all you can all keep the, uh, the drone in your line of sight as well. So it's a really great product, runs the Android OS. Out of the box, uh, DJI is going to be uploading the Go app to our Moverio apps market. So you can run the DJI Go app and you know be running out of the box. And so I had a chance to try these on. This is probably, I mean, to me, the best screen that I've seen. Where uh, you know the blacks are transparent, you can see right through it. And then one of the things that I found really useful was the trackpad on the unit itself for selecting through the DJI Go app. Um, I know that yesterday you guys announced a partnership with DJI. Can you talk a little bit about what that's going to hold for the future? Absolutely. So we were really excited to make that announcement. It's a collaboration uh, de co-development agreement with DJI where we're going to be developing next generation augmented reality apps for the skies. So if you think about it, if you look around, the sky, it's just uh, a blank canvas for us to project digital information, whether that's kind of projecting highways in the sky, post-flight uh, visualization or pre-flight visualization where you're putting a, a path in the sky and you wanted to see where your drone's gonna fly. Uh, and as it's flying, you can actually track it to see visually, to see it's, if it's along the right path. Uh, no fly zones, uh, you know, we're hoping to gamify the experience. So there, there's just so much more than FPV that I think we're gonna be doing with our glasses. And that's why we're really excited to be working with DJI and their SDK. No, that's great. So the um, looking through here, easily what I thought was the best display and easy, easiest to use because the binocular display. But what's the actual technology? That's the projection. What's the resolution? Like, what are what do people see in front of them? Kind of comparable to a screen, like size-wise and everything else. So you're going to see roughly uh, a 320-inch screen from 40 meters, it, and it really depends on how far you're focusing. So the further away you're focusing, the larger the uh, projected image appears. So the, the interesting thing is it does use OLED, and to your point, OLED means that black is completely transparent. So you can remain, you can keep line of sight with your aircraft if you know the app developer renders uh, anything in black. So the other thing is it's uh, 720p, so it's full HD. Uh, it's really important that it's binocular so that we can project in 3D. Uh, we've got motion sensors built into the glasses as well as the controller itself so that we can uh, track them independently so that we've also got GPS. So the glasses are really aware of where they're looking and, and where they are. Right, other than it floating in front of you, I hadn't actually thought about the 3D effect of the binocular. So with, when you guys get into AR stuff with DJI or with whatever else, you can actually project objects into a 3D space along that Z plane, right? Exactly. And that's, I think, when things get really exciting. So uh, availability, price, and then um, if people want to find out more about the BT300, where do they go? So the Moverio BT300 is going to be shipping in kind of the December, January time frame. It's uh, available for pre-order now at prelaunch.com slash Moverio, M-O-V, as in Victor, E-R-I-O, uh, for $799. And, you know, we're really just excited to be getting this out there into people's hands. That's awesome. Thanks so much. Thank you. All right, guys, so those are the BT300. They're um, really, I've taken a look at uh, a number of these. So I have the original BT200s. The BT300s, the screens are incredible. And compared to anything else that's out there, I've tried here at Interdrone, actually, two or three others um, that, were full, that were full FPV that you couldn't see through, which obviously isn't going to work for the FAA's visual line of sight. With these, I can tell you that you can actually see through, and this really provides a great experience. Much better than a single monocular one that goes over one eye. I tried those, I got some eye strain there, pretty hard to pretty hard to look at. And the other thing is that you really had to focus on that one little screen and you didn't really maintain line of sight with your drone. So tell me what you think below. Go check them out at the Moverio website. I have it down in the link below. Like they said, they have a pre-order right now, 799.
This is one of the things that I'm most excited about here at Inner Drone. I'm trying it on. I was just blown away at the quality of the screen. So you guys keep watching. I'll keep making videos. I'll talk to you soon.